you guys, welcome to your workout today. We have a workout with just one weight and one glider. So if you don't have a glider, it's super easy to substitute this. Um, if you have hardwood floors, a towel, like a dish towel, or a paper plate, a paper plate also works well on carpet. Um, so it will glide better, a towel won't glide on carpet, um, but a paper plate will. So let's go ahead and get started. You're gonna move your glider or your towel off to the side and move your weight off to the side. We're just gonna warm it up here. Soft bend in the knees, inhale, take those arms wide to a T, stretch it out, and exhale, round the spine. Hollow out that belly. Inhale, palms forward, pressing through the fingers, reaching longer, growing taller out of the top of the head, and exhale it down, close the arms. Nice work. One more, big deep inhale. And exhale all that air out. Nice work. Roll those shoulders out of the ears. We're going to start narrow to step out squat. So we're going to start narrow step out to the left, inner thigh squeeze. Left and squeeze. Good. Arms, take them together. Wide. So your arms are mirroring your legs. We're just heating up the whole body. Down, squeeze it in. Nice work. Lift through that right foot, press through all edges of that right foot, and lift, chest lifted, inhale down, exhale to lift, four, three, two, and one, nice job, other side, step it out, bring it in, nice work, so really pressing, springing up out of that left foot, down, pull it in. Open through the shoulders, pull it in. My shoulders are getting tired, not holding any weights. Down, pull it in, down, pull it in. Nice work. Three, two, and one. Center. Take it out wide. We're going to drop it down, pulsing plie. So take those arms out to a T, drop it down, pulse, pulse, lift, drop the arms lower. Pulse, pulse, press. Pulse, pulse, and press. Adjust your feet if you need to. Nice and tall here. Down. Squeeze those inner thighs. Down. And press. And down. And press three more. Good job. Two, you should be getting nice and warm. Last one, hold it low, hold. Tap those arms back, tap. Press, go longer through the fingers, reach. For the opposite side of the room, press those inner thighs back. Five, four, three, two, one. Stand nice and tall. Go ahead and grab your glider. From here, we're gonna take our glider underneath our left foot and pressing it out to the side. So you're gonna sit back into your right glute, take that glider out and lift it up. So it's down, press to the ground with the ball of your foot, either on the towel or on your glider, down, lift it up. Tall chest, open through the collarbone, down, and lift, down, pull it in. Five, four, three, two, on one, hold it out, little press. Sit back in that right hip, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, one, hold, zip up through that core. Even more weight in that right leg, lift and lower. For eight, for seven, for six, for five, for four, last three, two, and one. Bring it back in, nice job. Switching legs, other side. Take it out, pull it in. Press it out, pull it in. Running into my weight, <laughs> and out, pull it in, nice job. Lifting through that chest, and pull, down, and pull, nice work. Four more, four, three, two, on one, little press, press. Sit that left hip back in a chair, feel that left glute, press. Push into the floor with the right toes for four, Three, two, one, hold. Transition your weight to your left leg completely. Lift 
and lower. Squeeze those abs in nice and tight. Standing up, opening through that collarbone for six, for five, for four, for three, for two, and one. Stand it up. Nice job, shake it out. From here, we're gonna take it back into our traditional lunge. I'm gonna turn to the side here, taking my glider back under my left foot. So we're gonna drop it down, bring it in, lift the knee. Almost lost my balance, down. Bring it in, lift the knee up from the low abs. Press it back. In, pull it up. And back. In, pull it up. Whoop. Down, pull it in, lift it up. Stand nice and tall, I catch myself with my right knee shooting over my ankle. If you need a chair or something to hold on to, that would be good here. Lift, pull that knee in, down. Pull that knee in, two more, down, pull it in, last one, pull it in, nice job, lift, all right, take that leg back out, pull that left leg or that right leg in your lunge, bring that left knee in, press it back, in, press it back, bend and press, scrub that floor, bend and press, nice, open through the collarbone and press, five, four, Three, two, whoop, falling over, one. Good, now hinge it forward here. Hinge it forward, bring it in, press it long, lift that leg. Bring it in, press it long, lift. Now you're really feeling that right glute. Press, lift. If you need a chair to hang on to, have it in front of you, lift. This is my harder side, and lift. Two more, and lift. Last one, and lift, and bring it in. Woo. Shake out that right cheek. We're gonna turn towards the other side. I'm gonna face the other direction so you can see the leg that's going back. So standing nice and tall, square your hips off, and lunge it down, lift it up, and then lift the knee. Almost forgot the knee lift. Woo. Lost my glider, down, pull it in, lift. It's another whole challenge with this is keeping that glider with you, lift. Press it back, and lift it up. Down, and lift, nice job. For five, for four, really sit back in that left loop. For three, last two, and last one. Lift that knee, and then take that glider all the way back. Sink into your lunge. Hold your lunge with that left leg, bring that right knee in, press it back. In, press to that right heel, and press. In, and press, nice job. Four, three, two, and one. Hold it back long, tip the torso forward. Bring it in, press it back, and lift. Bring it in, so you're keeping that left glute turned on, you're hinged forward through your torso. Pointing through that right toe as you extend it, lift, find your glider, bring it in, out. Stable hips here, bring it in. Last four, for three, last two, and last one, bring it in, shake it out. Nice work, all right, you're gonna grab your one weight. Got my one weight here, you're gonna take your glider underneath your left foot, take your weight in your left or your right hand. Opposite hand, you're gonna externally rotate the feet. We're gonna side raise, take that left leg out, bring it in, out to the side, bring it in. A zip up through that core, press it out, bring it in. Press it out, bring it in. Lifting out of that right leg, so don't let the hips sag. Press, pull it in, heels tight, out. Pull it in for five. For four, for three, for two, and one. All right, now bring it back in, shift it forward. So bend through that right knee slightly. You're gonna take it overhead, take that left leg behind you, bring it in. Keep that soft bend in that right knee. Good, press it out, bring it in. Press it out, bring it in, you got it. Six, 
five, four, three, two, on one, hold it out, take it out to the side. So left leg goes to the left, right arm goes to the right, sweep it overhead. Out, stable abs here, stable hips, out, sweep, out, sweep it back. Four, three, two, and one. And bring it back on home. All right, training arms, training legs. Roll those shoulders back out of those ears. Heels together, ball of that foot on the towel or your glider. We're gonna side raise, take it out. Squeeze the inner thighs, out, pull it in. Press it long, pull it in with control. Zip up through those obliques, hold yourself nice and tall, nice soft bend in that left knee. Good, out, pull it in, good work. Out, pull it in. Five, four, three, two, on one, bring it back in, hinge it slightly forward, soft bend in that right, on that left knee, we're going to take that weight out, take the leg behind you, bring it in, out, bring it in, so you've got a slight tip in your torso here, out, bring it in, out, bring it in, nice job, out, bring it in, extra challenge if you rotate while you're doing it, out, bring it on home, two, on one, hold it out. Arm out to a T, leg out. Overhead, pull it back together. Good, hold in through those abs, soften in that left leg. For five, for four, three, you can do it, two, and one. Bring it up, bring it in, nice job. All right, so you're gonna grab your mat or if you have a soft surface to put the top of your body on. So we're gonna fold it, I've got my mat. Fold it in half here. I'm gonna take my glider behind me and my right foot is gonna go onto my glider. My left hand is gonna hold onto the weight. Coming into an all fours position here, we're gonna take your left elbow in tight towards your side and as you press that right leg long, you're gonna extend tricep press with that left arm. In and extend. In and extend. Nice job, press it long. Nice work, press. And press, Got those toes on that glider at a nice tabletop position, keeping those hips facing towards your mat. Nice work, out, pull it in, out, pull it in. Now hold in three, two, on one, hold the arm straight, take that right leg out to the side, bring it back behind you, out to the side, bring it back behind you. So the hips aren't moving here. Just the glider out to the side and behind you. Lots of ab stabilization. Last three, two, and one. Good, nice work. Drop that weight for a moment. Walk it back. You're gonna take it into a plank with that glider. Underneath your right toe, hold your plank. Find your nice tall plank. Now if this doesn't work for you, just gonna find a plank and hold. We're gonna pull that right knee in, press it long. Pull it in. Press it long for eight, seven. Not moving the hips, just the leg. For five, four, three, two, one. Good, walk it back up, drop the knee down and trade hands with the weight and trade legs with the glider. So, all fours position here, knees towards the back of your soft surface. And we're gonna take our right elbow into the side. Stabilizing through that left arm, nice soft bend. Draw in through the waist here. Take that left leg long, right arm long, bring it in. Press, bring it in. Press it long. Follow the foot on that glider. Nice job. Find a point about 12 inches in front of you to stare so you don't drop your neck like this. That's not good neck alignment. Press. And press, we care about the whole spine. Press. Good job. In three, you're going to hold. Two. And one. Hold it long. Hold. Hold your arm. Take that left leg out. Bring it back behind you. Out. Bring it back behind you. You've got it. Bring it back in. Only go out as far as you can control. Last four. Three. 
two, and one. Ooh, drop that weight. Walking it back. All right, other side plank. We're moving quickly here. So if the plank is what feels good for you, do that. Don't go outside of what feels good for your body. You wanna challenge yourself, but not be in pain. So hold here, bring that leg in, press it long. Leg in, press it long. Good. Press. In. Press. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Drop the knees down. All right, we're gonna do our final plank challenge with the gliding disc or with your towel if you're on the kitchen floor. You can pick a spot that needs to be scrubbed. You're gonna take it out and you're gonna take both feet on your glider. You're gonna press to a hover. Press it out, pull it in. Press it out, pull it in. Good, now can you pull to the left? Out, right, out, left, out. Now if you don't have a disc, you just hold your planks. Left, out, right. Two more sets, left, out, right. Out last one, left, Woo. right. Good, center and release. Nice job. All right, from here, transitioning to seated. Giving your wrists a break. We're gonna take that disc out in front of us here. I'm gonna take your left foot on the disc. You're gonna take your weight into your right hand and just let your breath come back to you for a moment. I like to take my heel into the disc for this work because I want my feet to stay heavy, my hips to stay heavy. So you're gonna take the left leg, glide out as you hinge back and the right arm goes by the ear, pull it back. So out, pull it back. This hand can come behind you, a little support, or you can take it out, out in front of you. Good, out, pull it in. My brain had to kick in what to do with it. Pull it in. If you need support, take it here. Nice, heavy hips, out, pull it in. Out, pull it in for four, for three, two, and one. Bring it in, nice job. Switching sides, other legs. Sit up nice and tall, hinge it back, pull it in. Hinge and pull, hinge and pull. Out and pull, good job. Out and pull. Use that opposite arm for a little bit of support, but you wanna keep your hips heavy or you can take it out in front of you. Out, pull it in, nice job. Four, three, two, and one. Bring it in nice and tall. Woo. Good job. All right, take both heels on that glider. Sitting up, you're gonna take the weight into both hands. So hold the weight with both arms. You're gonna extend out, hinge it back, pull it in, take the knees to the right, take the arms to the left. Out, other side. So heavy hips here, knees to the right, arms to the left. Knees to the left, arms to the right. Obliques. Hinge and pull. So press through that gliding disc or your paper plate. Work those hamstrings a little bit here. Try not to overwork the hip flexors or the front of the legs. Really deep dive into those low abs. And pull. I'm really feeling my abs here. Small hinge back. You don't have to go very far to feel the effects. And pull. And pull. Last two sets. Pull it in. Woo! Pull it in. Last set. Last side. And release. Nice job. All right, moving it on down to the floor. So you're gonna scoot yourself to the edge of your mat and lay on back. We're gonna keep our gliding disc with us here. Finding your bridge position. So feet hip distance apart. You've got your left ball of foot onto the gliding disc. We're gonna lift up. We're gonna press the disc out. Bring it in, lift like the ceiling, bring it back down, press it out. And articulate that leg up to the sky, find your disc, pull it in. It's a little bit of muscle memory to figure out where you left your disc. Now the goal here is to keep your hips stable. So we don't want the hips dropping off to the side. You wanna feel the stretch to the front of the leg as you extend it out, feel that stretch, don't drop the hip, lift it up. Already done this once today, so I'm a little tired. Lift. Good. And last one. 
I'll lift it up, lower it down with control. Now just pressing into the disc, just regular bridge lifts for eight, for seven, for six, for five, for four, for three, last two, and one. Lower down, switch that disc or your plate or your towel to the other side. Take the ball of your foot onto the top of that, lift up. All right, level hips here, press through that left leg. Take the right leg out long, bring it in, extend up. Take it out long, in, articulate that leg up. I will stretch my hamstrings out, out. Pull it in, press with your upper body into the mat. So use your triceps, don't develop any tension in your neck or your face here. Press it out, pull it in. Two more. Press through that whole left foot. Lift, last one. Out long and pull it in. Ground that foot onto that disc. Hip distance apart. Eight presses for eight. Both feet pressing into the earth. For six, squeeze the glutes. For five. For four. For three. For two. And one. Nice job. Woo. All right. Go ahead, take those legs out nice and long. We're gonna roll it up to seated. So inhale, exhale, lift up, up, up. Cut my body disc underneath me. Stretch it forward. Over those legs, fold it forward. We're gonna find a way to standing to stretch our glutes. I'm gonna move my disc out of the way. Hop them on up. Figure four, so take that right leg. Cross it over, sit back into those hips. Good, flex that foot. Nice work here, stand it up. Stretch through the front of the leg here. We did a lot of legs in that short workout. Good, and drop it down, left leg. Cross it over, flex that left foot. Sink it back if you need a chair. Hold on to something, it's a lot of balance to do this. And lift it up. See if you can grab that foot without letting it touch the ground. Holding onto your chair if you need it. Lift up out of that standing leg. And then release. Nice work. You just completed a full body workout with gliding disc and one weight. I hope you've enjoyed this workout and you'll join us again soon. Have a great day.